Now tonight, hundreds of thousands of 2015 KCP candidates are going to bed with either immense joy or disappointment after the official release of Kenya Certificate of Primary Education exam results. Even in the absence of national ranking, top performers danced a jig after getting scores way above 400 out of 500 possible marks. Here are some of those top performers. Um, so these are the results uh, as it were. Shortly after 11 a.m. Wednesday morning, Education Cabinet Secretary Fred Matiangi officially releases results of the Kenya Certificate of Primary Education 2015. These results and answer the question, what do they mean to each one of us? What's my part in it? How have I performed? And with that, the annual NDA celebration for those who have done well commences. The Isikuti rents the air in Kakamega town as residents sing and dance with the pride of the town, 14-year-old Agre Wabuko on their shoulders. He has been able to garner 449 marks, becoming one of the top students countrywide. It was tough reading till 12, waking up early 4, but it was worth it. These marks just didn't come easy. I tried my best, and I hope all of you pre-candidates, now you are candidates, please just follow our lead, and you will pass well. Kisi County is celebrating their girl Felistus Onduso who sat her exams in Gilgil and ran away with a harvest of 445 marks, beating hundreds of thousands of female and male candidates across Kenya. We would like to become a lawyer in future uh, because there is corruption worldwide and I want to be that voice that the innocent ones need so that I can, I can present them and they get justice. It's a similar situation in Mombasa County where parents, pupils and teachers from St. Kelvin celebrate their daughter Rhoda Ingefo who got 444 marks in the nationwide exam. I want to go to Kenya Girls High School and I want to do business when I grow up. In Kajiado, a lean but rather tall Hillary Tirimba calmly celebrates with his friends and family. More than eight years of education at Kauti Academy may now earn him a spot at one of the country's top high schools. He attained 446 marks. Shukuru, walimu, kwa kutufunza, wazazi, kwa kulipakaru, na wengine wote walioweza kuchangia katika kufaulu kwetu. Nairobi County saw similar levels of celebration by proud stakeholders. The Moe Educational Center, the Lakewood School, and Hillside Academy, just a few of those who have more than just one reason to celebrate this festive season after pupils from their schools ranking well in the examinations that recorded about 2,709 exam irregularities. I feel very proud of myself for I have achieved the greater success. Uh, we used to wake up at before four to study in, in the evening. We used to have preps in the evening, so we take uh, we had extra hours to study. So if you just concentrate on your studies and forget about everything else and just your studies, then you'll succeed. I put all my hopes in God and prayed. So I I knew that God will surely grant me the wish I. I no doubt the celebration for those who have done well will carry on well into the new year as parents and pupils now await the next phase that is Form 1 selection set to begin on the 21st of January 2016. Timothy Otieno, KTN News.